Ooh. Actually, that's not too bad. I think my, my sound is just too loud. Hello, everyone. Welcome yeah, to today's okay. Nintendo Direct Partner Showcase. Hello. In this presentation, we'll be focusing on Nintendo Switch games launching in the first half of 2024 from our publishing and development partners. Otherwise, Let's I have no idea headlines. what to expect. Strive to survive. Kind of assumed. Get ready to embark on an enormous adventure of pint-sized proportions. After being shrunken down at the hands of an evil corporation, you must explore a vast, immersive world. This game looks super fun. Your own yeah, grounded. Assemble this game looks super fun. And work together in I've never actually played this at all. Co -op with up to three um, friends, or take but I, I love co-op games. I've mentioned before that I love co-op games. And craft so the fact that this is going on the Switch 2 is pretty cool. To your I imagine that. Survival. I bet you kids will probably love this game. Use the tools you craft to forage plant life, but watch out. You aren't alone Trainer. Work your way through the campaign to uncover the mysteries of the backyard. Or build, share, and play your own creations in Playgrounds mode. Did yeah, see, it's just, it's a cute to game, man. In this <laughs> world and fend off its creepy, crawly inhabitants? Go big or never go home. When Grounded launches on the <laughs> Nintendo Switch system April 16th. Nice. A tale of destruction and renewal unfolds in this return to the Ender Lily's world. This once flourishing country sits atop a wealth of buried magic. This looks cool. Homunculi, artificial life forms created as the country flourished, were meant to bring about a brighter future. Ender Magnolia Bloom in the Mist? As Lilac, you'll reluctantly bond with and journey alongside a homunculus who played a pivotal role in the country's demise. <laughs> when the magic buried beneath the surface became corrupted, I love the, the art citizens style. fled upward to escape its reach. But those who lacked <laughs> power and wealth remained abandoned below. Along your journey, you'll battle rampaging homunculi. Upon liberating them, the creations will join you on your adventure. Oh, fun! your companions and lending their aid. That's what cool. Lilac this looks like it's gonna be fun. At the end yeah. Of their journey. Find out when Ender Magnolia Bloom in the Mist launches on Nintendo Switch this year. That looks cool. It's your adventure, your way in these Nintendo Switch games. I'm ready. Explore an interconnected world of puzzles in this charming adventure. Slide across rows and columns on a sprawling gameplay grid where everything moves when you move. Yeesh. Solve puzzles by venturing out into the wilderness, helping out the townsfolk, <laughs> and taking down monsters in handcrafted dungeons. What awaits you on this curious journey? That's a very interesting idea. I like that. Yours to solve in a ranger, a role puzzling adventure, sliding onto Nintendo Switch this summer. Can you imagine the speed run for that game? A young prince on a journey to liberate unicorn overlord. I love the title of this game. It actually looks good too. Form your strategy, then unleash your army on the opposing Zenoiran forces. Your real-time strategy planning will turn the tide of war. During battle, you may get to recruit new allies or be faced with difficult decisions. Atlas and Vanillaware present Damn Unicorn Atlas. <laughs> launching on Nintendo Switch March 8. A demo will be available today on Nintendo eShop. Oh, fun, a demo. Nice. I'm interested Originally in checking the demo out. on the Nintendo 3DS system, the first Monster Hunter Stories game returns. Now, I know a lot of people will be excited about that. As a rider, you'll befriend and fight alongside monsters cool. in turn-based combat to confront the black blight that plagues the world. Many familiar monsters from across the series are included. Plus, you can browse artwork and listen this to is music in a newly Hunter. added museum. Take flight in Monster Hunter Stories, soaring onto the Nintendo Switch system this summer. <laughs> A 
on a peculiar Is this the Wii day, game? Are they finally putting the Wii mirror, game on the Switch? <laughs> into his workshop. Yeah. Finding the magic paintbrush. A curious Mickey oh. creates a mess. <laughs> I've heard this game's great. Becomes trapped in a magical wasteland inhabited by forgotten and rejected characters. Horrifying. <laughs> the platforming adventure Epic Mickey returns. Oh! A faithful remake of the beloved classic. Explore this unusual dimension. I just expected this to be a port. Using the magic brush <laughs> to shape the world with paint and paint thinner on the path to huh. become an epic hero. Cool. Disney Epic Mickey Rebrushed launches on Nintendo Switch this year. Fun. Next, please take a look at this. I hate when they do this. It's always something that blows my mind. What is it? Shimigami Tensei 5 DLC? I'm afraid Tokyo experienced its own peculiar occurrence while you were away. I'll be counting on you to gather more intel on the matter. I suspected to be traveling back and forth between Tokyo and the Netherworld. This place is definitely dangerous. And that's about all we know right now. Look out! Ooh! Who are you? Now let's kill this thing. And so we have found it. The key to the resurrection. Fighting with another person? This is where you prove you can fight! You think you can just fly Damn. in and be a hero? If it wasn't for you, my brother would never have been dragged into this war. You're not alone. If you want revenge, then I'll help you get it. Allow me to remind you how you were wronged by this world. Atlas has been popping off the last few years, man. Vengeance. That, that, that's, a, <laughs> that's, that's a really cool logo. <laughs> That looks so good. Enter or return to this ravaged wasteland and experience an untold story on your adventure. Let's take a look at some more headlines. More headlines. Woo! What do we got? Get ready to unite and fight in these Nintendo Switch games. I don't want to fight. Fight in iconic battles from across the Star Wars galaxy in this collection of two classic games. No shit. <laughs> 64 players can strike back against familiar no way. In massive online That's so cool. Oh my god, the people in the Star Wars community are probably losing their Fisto, shit right now. <laughs> additional maps like Jabba's Palace. Plus, battle as your favorite heroes or villains in Hero Assault. No fucking way. That's cool, man. On maps including Death Star and Naboo. Star Wars Battlefront Classic Collection I... launches on the Nintendo Switch system <laughs> March 14th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo Wii Shop. I loved the Battlefront games. They were so fun. A oh, stick of truth. <laughs> Let's go, Stan. Snow day, everyone. Welcome to South Park. As the new oh, it's a new game. game. Join Cartman, Stan, and the rest of the gang to save the town in this co-op action game. Choose from a wide range of iconic South Park items and cosmetics to co customize action your game? character however you'd like. Once you're set, it's time for battle. Take on an avalanche <laughs> of enemy factions in solo play or online co-op with up to three friends. Grab your gang and head into the fray in South Park Snow Day. Launching on Nintendo Switch, March 26th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. It's a snow day, dude! Sharpen your steel for the I latest mean... entry in the Sword Art Online series. When the virtual world goes haywire. All right, real quick, okay? Real quick, real quick. I know Sword Art Online gets a lot of hate. I know that Sword Art Online gets a lot of hate. The most recent season that you can watch, the Alice Dissertation or however the fuck you say it, it is so good. Like, I loved that like that saga so much. It was so good. Super, super fun. So I am I am back into Sword Art Online again. Yes. Alongside former adversaries and fallen allies, it's up to you to save the world. Experience a whole new single player story or take the battle online with up to 20 players in co-op play. 
Damn. Sword Art Online Fractured Daydream launches on Nintendo and for what it's worth this year. Their video games are usually good. Break, build, and battle your ultimate Gundam in Gundam! <laughs> Choose from over 250 base kits. Combine and customize their parts to build your very own mobile suit model known as Gunpla. Then Gunpla. put your creation to the test in a variety of combat missions. By defeating enemies and acquiring new parts, you can equip more abilities to craft the ultimate Gunpla. Plus, you can show off your builds and snap picks in the new diorama mode. Nice. Prepare for battle when Gundam Breaker 4 launches on Nintendo Switch this year. Looks good. Looks pretty fun. Let's get down to monkey business. Is this a new game? The newest entry in the Super Monkey Ball series rolls onto Nintendo Switch. Over 200 brand new stages await with optional motion control. That's a nice coworker. <laughs> Using the new spin dash move, you can blast over obstacles and create shortcuts to victory. This is. <laughs> These games are so Have a cute. Ball with friends and family in four player local co op. Time to race. <laughs> to 16 players can battle online as they tilt their way this to be fun. the top banana. <laughs> be the first to the finish line in race mode. Yeah, dude. Grab the falling bananas in Banana Hunt. And there's multiple game modes. Team up to take down robots in Robot Smash and more. I love it. I love it. Get ready to roll, tilt, <laughs> dash, and party in one appealing Aww. adventure. Nah, the it Super looks cool. Monkey Ball Banana Rumble launches exclusively on the Nintendo Switch system Exclusive. June 25th. Wow. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. The lag, yeah. Hopefully the online play is good. Get ready for a Goo! good time. A good. <laughs> it's liquidy. That was, that was it's lame. Solidy. It's <laughs> goo. Stretch it, shape it, and use it to build strategic structures. I know a lot of people are excited about this. Puzzler, you can I never played towers, the first one, so I, I can't, bridges, I can't like and even say anything in particular. Whatever this is. What? Your goal is to guide as much goo as possible into a vast global pipe distribution network. But where do the pipes lead? Certainly nowhere sinister. Put your imagination to the test <laughs> as you build. Certainly no sinister. Explode, destroy, fly, <laughs> and roll your goo to the goal. You'll encounter different types of goo balls with unique properties, including explosive goo, jelly goo, and more. Fun. Plus, exclusive to the Nintendo Switch version, you can build with up to three buds in local co-op play. No online. World of Goo 2 launches as a console exclusive on Nintendo Switch May 23rd. Okay. Build a life transcending time. I can style this one too. Craft your story 1,000 years in the making in a brand new fantasy life game. This, this is fantasy life? This island in the seas of Riveria now stands deserted. Travel to the island's past to gather resources, then use them to restore the island in the present. You'll start out by assuming one of the Oh, they have jobs, dude. Oh my god, this is gonna be perfect. I can't wait for this. Door. How about a magician to take down monsters? Or even a carpenter to craft furniture. <laughs> you can swap between these lives and many more as you rebuild the island. Oh, this is so cool. As you travel through time, you'll gradually uncover truths about your new island home. Additionally, up to four players can journey together online. Nice, they have co-op. Invite friends to the island and set off. And it's to online too. The secrets that lie in store. <laughs> this life is yours I do, to I do in. know. <laughs> Fantasy Life I, the girl who steals time. Oh, that's going to be Nintendo so Switch, good. October 10th. I can't wait for that. I loved, time to I loved uh, the Fantasy Life on the 3DS. It was so much fun. It was the so world much fun. These days is dark and mean. Even the water tastes unclean. Need I remind you all how threatening the ocean is outside this reef? Scour the depths <laughs> of a polluted undersea world in this souls like adventure. I uh, recently had my shell taken away. If you can go get that. Souls like?
I feel like, are we just tossing these words out like willy nilly now? <laughs> treasure there, John, about I'll gladly trade yourself for it. Protect yourself with whatever you can find, from cans to cardboard, <laughs> during your One. hunt to reclaim your prized shell. It would appear the hunt is on, I say. I, I, I've been working my butt off trying to get my old life back. But you'll run into a few crabby predators along the way. <laughs> I can work out a deal, <laughs> That treasure's as good as mine. Use over 60 ability granting shells and harness powerful umami magic to take umami down enemies magic. in frenetic deep sea combat. Oh my what gosh. other threats lie in the ocean depths? As they say, one crab's trash is another crab's treasure. Launching on Nintendo hey, Switch cute. April 25th. It looks cute. These Nintendo Switch games will have you dashing, yeah. dropping, and drilling. It's definitely interesting. Join Penny and Yo-Yo in a brand new 3D platforming adventure from the team that that's brought right. you Sonic Mania. Yeah, that's why Dash, I was excited about this. I was swing, like, I recognize ride, this. Why would I like master it? Master the cosmic string in over 40 levels across 11 vibrant worlds, all while outrunning a massive penguin army and a colorful cast of bosses. Feast on power Looks good. to activate transformations. Help out the denizens during your acrobatic escapades and put your tricks to the test in a time attack mode. It's made by the folks that made Sonic Mania. Because Penny's Big Breakaway launches on Nintendo Switch today. Oh, it's today. Oh, it's just right now. Okay, that's cool. All right, cool. Sweet. Local Sweet. Local two-player battles are coming as paid DLC to the fruit-matching phenomenon, Sweeka Game. Choose it's from on. three modes. Original, <laughs> time limit, and attack. Aim for higher score it's than on. in original mode. <laughs> Make split second decisions against the clock in time limit mode and overwhelm your opponent with bunches of fruit in attack mode. Yes! Plus, oh, I love online this. Online multiplayer will be added to the DLC in the future. Oh, it's not it's not Get online battling. right now. When this paid DLC for Suica game drops onto the Nintendo Switch system today. Oh, okay, never mind. A bundle of the game and DLC is also available today. <laughs> Get oh, I love this already. Drilling, drilling in the 2D action platformer Pepper Grinder. That was horrifying. Burrow through terrain. Pulverize enemies in your way. And ride on gnarly vehicles to recover your missing it's, it's, fortune. It's, it's that person right there. Pepper They're the one drilling, not me. Onto Nintendo Switch March I love the art style, though. Be available today on Nintendo that looks very fun. E that looks cool. Giddy up for a fusion of solitaire and horse racing in this remastered version of Pocket Car Jockey. Take cards to create a sequence of numbers and build up power during a race. Check the positions of other horses, spend power to move around the course, and grab special cards to gain the upper hoof. Upper hoof. Win events to get new horses, then breed them to race the, the next generation the of ideal steeds. <laughs> You can even race online against other players. It's off to the races in Pocket Car Jockey. Who's Ride the best on. solitaire Launching player? Switch <laughs> today. Oh, it's today. Of course it's today. What else is today? Pentiment. So Pentiment's coming to the Switch. This game looks very good. I saw we saw this at the Game Awards. This game looks very good. I'm excited about this one. <laughs> Is that a rhythm game? <laughs> huh. Contra? Wake up feeling drunk. <laughs> That's what coffee's for. Pentiment, man, I always wanted to play this game. I wish I would have started it. It's available tomorrow. Obviously, I'm memeing. I know I started it and never finished it. I'm sorry. <laughs> that almost wraps up this Nintendo Direct Partner Showcase. But before we go, I gonna hurt me. Two more announcements to share. Two? First, please take a look at this. Uh oh.
What is this? <laughs> this looks cool. Battle Toads. I saw Battle Toads. This is all. This is all NSO stuff. Killer Instinct. Killer Instinct. People are gonna be excited about that. Dakota, welcome on. Good to see you. These games are available today. Of course, they're today. Why not? You can play them with an active <laughs> Nintendo Switch Online or Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack membership. Next is our last announcement. Uh -oh. Please take a look. Is this Subnautica? Same mask. No, endless ocean luminous. A mysterious underwater world is yours to explore in an all new endless ocean game. Welcome to the Veiled Sea, this is, a location this is a sequel? known to very few people. This unexplored region changes with each dive, offering new things to discover. Fun. Up to 30 players online can plunge into the ocean's depths. Look, it's Grace! Grace Here is in a trailer! <laughs> and exchange a friendly greeting. Oh, yeah, I'll eat most. That's fun. Exploring the vast ocean. <laughs> She'll see food. Sushi! Yeah, this is cute. There are over 500 different species of marine life to encounter. This is cool. Some of them are creatures thought to be extinct, and others may be mythical. Mythical? Real fish snap, basically. <laughs> oh, they have 50. <laughs> This game, mid, doesn't have 1,500 fish, mid. <laughs> Endless Ocean Luminous launches on the Nintendo Switch system May 2nd. Nice. Pre-orders begin today. I Nintendo imagine they said that they said a new a new Endless Ocean, so I imagine that's not the first game, but I've never heard of it before. To exploring cool. the vast ocean on Nintendo Switch. That's yeah. all for today's Nintendo Direct Partner Showcase. Well, fun. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Fair and valid mask. <laughs> I am a student unicorn overlord. That does look good. The epic Mickey thing was interesting. The battle. F oh, dude, that looks so good. <laughs> Super Monkey Ball. They had a lot of good stuff today. Fantasy Life. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I love that game so much. I really hope the Switch game is fun. Well, that was a, that was a fun showcase. I like that. I like that. That was fun. You know, nothing nothing crazy there. I don't think I, I got to see something that I was really excited about, so I'm happy. <laughs> You're not gonna hear me complain. Um, the fantasy light thing is cool. The new stuff for NSO, so like the uh, Battle Toads stuff like that. I imagine the N64 game is something that people like quite a bit, but I've not heard of it before. I think it was called Blast Core. I saw the stars and stuff, and I was just like, surely this means that <laughs> no. But yeah, lots of cool stuff there, man. Fantasy Life stuff was cool. Shin Megami Tensei 5 DLC. I wasn't expecting that, to be honest with you. Um, so that's neat. Yeah, overall, it was just a just a solid showcase, man. That was cool. That was cool.